we are at the Space Needle. My mommy is taking pictures with her new smartphone. I'm still excited about that. Hi, mommy. <laughs> we decided to take a trip over to Seattle. How have you been, mom? Been good. Been good. Are you excited to be up at the Space Needle? I am. I haven't been up here forever. Neither of us have. Right. And we want to see the cool glass floors and everything. So that's going to be fun. So. Oh yeah, that'll be fun. Yeah. I'm going to put a little warning on this video for anyone who is sensitive to heights. And movement. And movement. <laughs> <laughs> we can just stand on it, right? Okay, cool. I feel so weird about it. Oh, Woo! You can lay on it, you can jump up and down on it if you want to. Ooh. I love it. <laughs> you see how just we are walking like we expect it to I know. It's kind of like lure. Okay, so this is the rotating floor. You can, I don't know if you can tell that. Let's see if I can show the movement against the floor. You can see it a little bit. Oh, this is so cool. How does it make you feel, Mom? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I am I I am so like thrilled by height. So this is like a dream come true for me. Oh my gosh, the monorail! Look at the monorail down there. So cool coming out of the EMP museum, by the way. It's okay, you don't have to look down. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. And we're up there. Oh, you can see the fountain. Stadium there, and you actually can see it moving out a little bit. Painted on. I'm, I'm a proper five. Uh huh. Look at this cool little lounge area with the glowing chair. How oh, fancy! It's next to a little bar that's reserved for. Look at these glasses. That red one's so cool. Anyway, it's reserved for like events and stuff. But look at that view around the whole thing. But I don't want to like get a bunch of people on the video. Right. I'm trying to show them without showing anything. Okay. <laughs> 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 I'm just taking you guys a little gander around here. Try not to get a bunch of people in it so I may not film the whole thing. And look at the window. I like a little bit of So epic, the beautiful mountain scape. Above the jungle of buildings. Nature. Jungle of buildings. Nature. <laughs> There's the great wheel. Around the glistening water. Oh, also, for all intents and fun purposes. Our, the red car down there is our car. <laughs> I took pictures, but I didn't make a video of it. That really red one right in the center, about the center. Yup. <laughs> I thought I captured it on so here. We're in a safe zone where we can take our masks off, sit for a second, and drink some water. So, but it's kind of nice. Let me flip the camera around and show you guys. Well, I should probably not have my mask face down. Yikes. <laughs> um. I think we'll be safe. <laughs> Maybe, but I don't want to breathe it in. That's true. It does feel nice to just kind of sit for a second and take it all in. <laughs> just to update you, I did sanitize the table where I put my mask down, so I promise you I'm being safe. <laughs> Over 100 years ago. On the other side of Lake Union, you can see Gasworks Park, formerly the sole remaining coal gasification plant in the United States. It was reopened in the public park in 1975. As we arrive at Space Base, we remind our guests to maintain a safe social distance between groups and to continue to wear masks in accordance with Washington State law. Hello guys, I just wanted to just wrap up this vlog real quick. My mom and I had a wonderful time at the Space Needle. After, after that, we wanted to go get food and I just wanted to also throw this in that if anyone's planning to go to the Space Needle, totally do it. They have all these amazing safe precautions. They, you know, have limited amount of people, so if you do, get your tickets ahead of time. Um, but we didn't have to wait in one line. Like, we li I don't even know if I said this already in the video, but we didn't have to wait in a line. It was so quick going through up to the Space Needle, and then we 
walked around and then got to go experience the beautiful glass um, ground as well, or glass floor as well, which was super cool. We wa so when we went to go get food, uh, we discovered that the armory is closed, so anyone who wants to take a trip to space, the Space Needle, um, the food courts and the restaurants around are closed. So definitely plan ahead for that one. But we just came back to our side in our, our little city and we went to our favorite pizza place, Zeke's Pizza. So my mom actually hadn't tried this until today. And yes, I brought the box in because I thought that would be cool. Don't know why, no kidding. Uh, but yeah, Zeke's Pizza originated in Seattle. There is one in Seattle and I almost thought about just having us go to that one because it's really close to Space Needle. Then I was like, oh, why don't I just go back to our side and then eat there because I knew you could do dine-in. But very careful, of course. They, it's the same precautions that most restaurants who are allowing people to sit down are, uh, like, sit down at. It's very safe and everything. So, yeah, we came over to our side. We went to Six Pizza. We sat down. We had some pizza and salad. Got to continue talking. And it was just so wonderful to catch up with my mommy. I haven't seen her for a few months, you guys. So it really was cool. And so after that, we went to the downtown park and took a loop around our downtown park, and it was it was very fun. And we came back here. But yeah, I did want to show you something real quick. You might notice that one before we get to that, I'm wearing a fantastic JoJo Siwa shirt. I'm going to be posting a separate video where I kind of show my new outfit and some of my new things that I have, just because I'm so excited about it. Anyway, so my mommy. She gave me my birthday present today because we weren't able to see each other around my birthday. And it's like, so my whole life, um, my nickname for my parents was Ladybug. I don't know if I've ever said that on here, but I always loved that little nickname. And so she got me this very cute uh, Ladybug necklace that when you open it, hold on, let me first go like this so you can actually see it. And then when it's sparkly and then when you open it, it's little wings. It's engra it says engraved, I love you. I don't know if you can read that because it's shiny. It says, I love you. And then there's also a little chain, a little uh, charm here that says, you're my love bug or you're my little love bug. It's very cute. And she also got me Trolls World Tour, which I haven't seen yet. So I'm excited to watch that. And a candle and some of her soap that she makes, which I absolutely love. So I'm very excited. Anyways, I just wanted to share the rest of my day with you guys, and I hope you enjoyed the little vlog, and I'll talk to you again later.